In this video, we're going to review the standard MI Freedom program commands, as well as the extended program commands. We'll start by clicking the Freedom button, and we'll click the question mark again to look at the list of commands. We're going to focus on commands 71 through 76, as well as commands 37 and 57. Let's click the back arrow key, and then we'll turn on a program. Let's enter 71, pound, program one, which is the greens in this example, send. And now we can turn on our entire program of greens. As you'll notice on the screen, we're about to see a lot of heads turning on. We can turn them off using command 72, pound one. So command 71 turns them on and command 72 turns them off. Let's zoom into hole nine. If we want to turn on one program, let's say one green in that program, we enter 71, pound, program one, hole nine, and hit send. To turn it off, we enter 72, then the back button, and send. And now the green is turned off. Next, we'll review how to advance a program. Let's use hole seven for this example. If we want to run our fairway, we enter 71 for turn on, pound, program eight for fairways, and number seven is the hole, then send. And now we can see all of the heads starting to come up on hole seven. To advance the heads, we enter command 74, which is the advance feature. If we click the back button, it will automatically add the rest of the command structure. And when we click send, we're going to see the first group of heads turn off and the next set of heads turn on. We could do that again if we wanted to advance even more. Again, command 71 turns on, 72 turns off, and 74 is advance. Next, we'll look at command 75, which allows us to pause. Let's imagine we have golfers coming down the hole. If we enter 75, pound eight, pound seven, or we could have used the back button, then hit send, we're going to see those heads go into pause mode. And now the golfers can play through. Once they have exited the hole, we can use command 76 to resume. We enter 76, click the back button, and now the heads come back on. To turn the program off, we enter 72, pound, program eight, hole seven, and send, and it turns off. So those are the standard program commands. Let's also take a look at commands 37 and 57, which allow us to look at the schedule data and also the status. Let's say we have a fairway program running. We'll enter 71 to turn on, eight, which is turning on a fairway program, and then send. This turns on the entire fairway program, which you can see happening across the whole map. If we zoom out a little bit, we can actually see all of the heads running. Command 57 lets us look at the status of that program. So if we want to know which holes are actually running in that program, we enter 57, eight, then send. And it shows we have active schedules running on holes one, two, three, five, seven, eight, nine, 11, and 12. You probably notice that there aren't any heads running on holes four, six, and 10. These are the next set of fairway heads that will come on in this example. But Command 71 allows us to see the status of whatever is physically running in that program. To turn that off, we enter 72, pound, eight, and send. The last command we're going to review is command 37, which has a few features. One, it allows us to do temporary program adjusts, but it also allows us to adjust our program. We were just using hole number eight, so let's look at that one again. We enter 37, pound, eight, and hit send and it says we can auto or ET. So to run auto, we would just click there. 
If we want to change the days of the week, we can actually click here. Keep in mind that Monday is 1, Tuesday is 2, Wednesday is 3, etc. We can leave this set to Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday, but we're going to adjust it down to 75% and click Submit. And now we've actually changed that program. If we take a look at our fairway program, we can see that it's only running now on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Sunday. It's pretty nice to be able to make those changes right from here. And finally, let's run through a temporary program adjust using the command 37, which we'll do on program one. We enter 37, pound, one, which gives us the information on hole one. We can see that it's running every day of the week. Let's do a temporary station adjust to program one, which is our greens. It's been kind of wet, so we're going to dry things up a bit. Let's adjust this down to 50% for the next three days and click Submit. And now you will notice in here that we've now changed it to 53. To recap, on the standard MI Freedom program commands, 71 turns on, 72 turns off, 74 advances, 75 pauses, 76 resumes, 37 provides schedule data, and 57 provides program status information. Thanks for watching.